guys welcome back to my kitchen now i have already started something i'm doing a little canning so let me fill you in on what i'm doing here so usually i wash my cranberries i put them in freezer bags seal them and put them in the freezer for preservation to get to use throughout the months however my freezers are pretty full right now so this girl is doing a little more canning this year and so i am can by the way i have a canning video that i talked about the apples that i canned for the first time and so i have um five jars here of cranberries basically i washed them thoroughly and then i put them in a pot and pour water over them just to cover them then i let it come to a boil and boil it just i think it was less than five minutes because cranberries don't need a lot of boiling i didn't want everything to disintegrate right and then i used my ladle to ladle the contents into the jars and now i am getting ready to cover them but i learned a little trick because usually i just pour my stuff in i'm not a canner so i just pour my stuff in the jars and i screw the lids on but what i learned is that before you screw your lids on you need to make sure that the top of the jar here is all cleaned up and that is because you want to get a proper seal so that is one thing you have to be sure to do when you do your canning another thing i learned which makes sense right is when you're putting your jars in the pot make sure that the water in the pot is about the same temperature as the contents you have in the jars and that is to prevent your jars from breaking but i'm just gonna go ahead and clean the rest of the top of these jars so now i have cleaned all my jars i'm gonna go ahead and put the lids on and you don't want to put them too tight right now i'm gonna get the jars into the pot so i have some water in the pot however i am not quite sure if i have enough water in the pot i will see if i don't i'll have to add more water because the water is actually supposed to come up about two inches above the top of your jars is put this little bowl on top of the jars with some water inside just to make sure that the jars stay down while they are being while the pot is boiling um, and so what I'll do now is cover the pot let it come to a roaring boil and then let it boil for 25 minutes let's go ahead and flip these upright oh did you hear that just made that sound there we go okay so thank you for watching the videos guys if you learned something please leave your thumbs up um, leave a comment below and subscribe you take care now i'll see you in the next video